Doom running on SQL, a large language model running on a Commodore 64, and DIY professional panels. Here are three maker stories you might have missed. Patrick Trainer has gotten a playable version of Doom running in an SQL database. It does use a little bit of JavaScript, but it's just to handle keyboard inputs and to kind of orchestrate a lot of sections of SQL. But all the game logic, the movement, the world state, shooting, it's all done inside SQL. Even the graphics are raycasted with ASCII stored in SQL. It's just really done creative. Now it is technically a Doom-like demo and not the full game, but you can get it going in a few minutes in your browser. Just go and try it. Marcevidkowiak, I'm, I'm very sorry I butchered that Polish pronunciation, has ported an LLM to the Commodore 64. Now, it's not an LLM like ChatGPT, but a version of Llama 2. It's running the Tiny Stories model, which is like, quote, prompting a three-year-old child with the beginning of a story, which they'll continue to the best of their vocabulary and abilities. If you have one lying around, you can check out his repo for it, or maybe even check out his Bitcoin miner that works on a Commodore 64 as well. A YouTuber accidental site is a really simple way to create high quality panels for your projects. You take your panel design, print it out on a regular home printer, varnish the front, paint the back white, two-part epoxy to hear it, and then hit it with another layer of varnish. It sounds simple and there is a bit more in those steps, but with it you can make some pretty darn professional panels for your project. And if you want to follow our sources or submit your own news for next week, you'll find a link to our forums in the bio.